welcome back to my channel it's your girl azine williams how are you all doing hope you guys are good hope you guys are fine if you're new to the channel can you click on the subscription button click on the notification bell to let you know whenever i post any new video okay guys so last night was very chaotic and dramatic big brother's children were moving mad fans were moving mad Oh, more drama here and there. I mean, you would think, okay, oh, we are done with this drama. Another one is happening. In fact, it's even kind of like, you know, went, you know, near Big Brother Titan housemates too. Yes. Ah, Big Brother should just come and carry his children because at this point, we cannot can anymore. So what exactly happened? Aside from the Fina and Bella Wahala, you know, the whole thing that happened, Bella unfollowing Fina and later on she came back, you know, and followed Fina back. That was some unnecessary drama, trust me. Very, very unnecessary. Anyways, aside from that, there was also um a beef that we actually thought was buried back in what? 2019, 2020. We did not know that this beef was just marinating yes only to be resurrected last night and i'm talking about the whole pepper them you know um beef between ella messi ak and venita now some of us actually thought we're done with that honestly i mean if we're to talk about pepper them beefs that are still ongoing I probably wouldn't talk about the whole Ella situation, but Ella came on Instagram Live and she demanded an apology. Yes, a public apology from Venita and Messi AK. Now, for those of you who are not in the know of what actually happened, let me give you the background, the background gist. Yes, guys. So, um, back at their reunion, so um, at some point, um, Venita called out. Ella stating that, you know, Ella has been coming to them for money. You know, there was the instance of, you know, saying that she needed money for her mom's medical bills or something like that. And, you know, even in the big brother group chat that they have, they contributed money and she could not even account for the money that she received. Like it almost looked like she was lying, you know, to collect money from them. Yes, guys. And at some point in the whole Wahala, Mercy, you know, got upset and was like, do you what understand? do you do with your resources? What do I do with my resources? Yeah. Since, as in, since, as in, what resources? The what? little one you have. I just take care of my mom. Do you do drugs? Do I do drugs? I I, I don't do drugs. Don't, please don't. If I don't do, do I, I take care of my girl, mom and I have any, I have been putting talk. my recent- That was what Mercy said. Um, uh, Ella could not really defend herself. Some of us actually felt sorry for her because I can remember, you know, I covered that gist. Some of us felt sorry for her, like, okay, why are they ganging up on her? It's not fair, blah, 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 blah. And we all thought, okay, oh, they've moved on. Everybody has settled and all whatnot. But, mm, we were wrong because, like I said earlier, Ella came out and she was ranting. Yes, I'm going to be playing a clip of some of the things she said, then I'll come back and tell you what I think about it. The same, we had makeup room. We got ready. You couldn't ask me shit. Nothing else could pop up in your head. I wasn't even your friend like that. And you had the boss to ask me if I did drugs. And tell me where you saw me do drugs. You to think and also Benita, I'm calling you out too to come and give me the receipts you have for thinking that. get me aggravated like that. Get me woke, get me lit like that. Three years ago, but guess what? It's still haunting me. So what lies? Is it? Would you have been called a mother and still f down there because you couldn't do anything? It was like, you know what? Hold on. Let me go. But when I come back, best believe. I'll be ready. So you said call a lawyer. Eh? Now I want to tender the case out. Because you ruined me. Your question ruined me. Okay, on reverse, Messi, do you really do because you have to be on want to not be thinking straight that you were on national TV and to think that multi-choice was not finna post it because you are who? Is their content they will post it? You thinking that is us dirty? You even victimized yourself to be part of me. You apologized on there, but can I come on public to apologize to me and say, "Oh, that stuff I said, I just said it." It didn't go away. It has not gone away. 
taken away. I demand an apology unless every time I will come out here and I'll keep saying your name. I don't want to be friends with you. you for you to put somebody down. Did you hear what Cindy said in the voice note? Cindy said this is a woman putting a woman down. If you perceive any ask me outside. Did they put you up to it? Why did you put me outside? Oh, and then I was waking it up earlier today and Diane by mistake I had respect for you, Diane. But right now I don't have respect for you. You smoke loud for Jackie Brady. I keep saying this. But Pam Pam had already told me on paro for Dubai and how you have to do some things so that you my lawyer even said on it's clear we can't do a lot of things that we keep in it. So I need that clear. So whoever hear me, I am calling out your favor right? because I'm not bitch. No more. Everything you got, I got it right now. So let's do it. If it's physical fighting, let's fight. If it's public apology, let's do anyone that have the energy for it. How the f you live with yourself, Mercy? How the f you do that? Oh, first of all, oh, she asking, she begging, she begging. God will not let anybody be in a situation where they have to beg. That's all I gotta say. Because if you think it reverse was the case, you that probably drunk. Tell your favorites that Ella is looking for. That thing you said three years ago, she's already dug it back off. It's fresh. It's fresh. Yesterday, just yesterday, somebody asked me again. I'm like, this thing, she must sit down somewhere, cross her legs. I want to say every time I come on live, I'm gonna call her name. Maybe make her a little bit famous, but she gotta understand that what she did was not right. What all of them did was not right. I have issues with every body, including Toyo, I paid money to. He had a station where I work, which I did not like. Focused on my because it's tea. I don't give a they didn't help me. They didn't call me after and say, as an alumni, what can I do for them? They didn't do nothing like that. They was like, oh, yes, she said that, she said that. They did a fake handshake and do it all. No one. Not one bit. One thing I do regret is doing that song for you. For Bad man was angry because they... So after the whole thing, I saw Ella. I went to her, called her, I said, Ella, are you okay? She said she was fine, everything was fine. And I told her, do you need a hug? And then we hugged it out. And then I saw she was feeling better, she was smiling. And then I moved forward. Who was that? for you. So I just felt that post was unnecessary, you know? I felt the post. When I saw it, I was like, this is unnecessary. This is now creating more drama to the whole stuff. That was why I called Ella. Right. Okay, Cindy was on my side. Cindy really was so saying... I sent I sent I sent that screenshot because I was really surprised. See, guys, the worst thing that will happen is to associate yourself with someone that would help you. And then at a critical point like this, they're like bringing out something, you know, just to create more drama. You guys know I don't like drama. Like, I like to disassociate myself from drama or SS gossiping and all those stuff. So, when I saw the post, I was, I really felt bad. I tried calling Ella. I called her like twice, didn't go through. So, I'm really concerned. Even the day that this whole thing happened, because we were there. We were there. City, you know we was there. I remember what I told you. I told you. Like, women bringing down women. Women bringing down women. So, you started explaining, like, the reason and why this and that. And I was like, okay, well. And then we moved on to other topics. I don't have all that kind of time. The reason why I posted that is just, I like what you said when you just apologized to Ella. That's very mature. I love that. That apology was some nonsense apology. I'm trying to get there. And, and Messi basically told Ella to stop doing drugs. You see this, how the blogs make it look bad, but you just asking me nonsense questions. I'm like, what the f is going to scare me and scare Brand? What shouldn't have shown up at the reunion. Y'all know what this can do to me. It's gone past apologizing here. Messi, you have to clear the air. I don't like it. She said, girl, I never said you do drugs. You see that? I'm like, yo. She said, I asked if you did drugs. Get a lawyer if you feel I don't have the freedom of expression. Honey, I'm going to you three years after but you have to explain to me where you see me because i fought listening to ella and the whole live stream and everything like that baby's hurt 
she's hurt i mean she showed us a lot of the group chat they had you know messi telling her to get a lawyer that she never said she did drugs that it was just a question women um cindy talking about women bringing down other women diana or diane trying to step in she called toyo it's very obvious that ella has not gone past that she feels like that statement and also the interpretation the blogs gave to it hurt her hurt her career hurt her music hurt you know her to the extent that brands would not want to work with her do i understand where she's coming from definitely i do i don't know if the channel she used would is like the right channel i don't know you don't tell people you know within this time frame this when you know you are to heal or or um, this is what should get you pissed or not i understand her but i just didn't think that that was the right way to go about it that's what i think about it anyways moving on so tabang had you know a an interview yesterday and during the interview you know how interviewers can be they were like um kiss um block marry whatever and he said okay uh, I haven't spoken to Kosi, so I'd have to block her. Uh, for now, I don't know who or not. Um, but yeah, I'd definitely uh, be kissing the listener. Oh, um, uh, Kosi's fans were really, really furious. Kobang shippers were furious. They were like, they are going to unfollow Tabang and all that. And Tassi put this out on Twitter. I'm like, is this or does this have anything to do with what Tabang said? Hmm. Anyways, drama, drama, drama. And oh my goodness, if you think the drama has ended, that's a lie. Because... Um, remember the whole, you know, engagement thing that we're all happy about, you know, for Saga? Apparently, it was a skit. Mm-hmm. Saga, Sena, skit. Listen to him, people of God. It's an old, it's an old video, anyways. The old video, that one? Yes, from December last year. Yeah. The man not in December, we don't know. Uh, you see what I talk? I said, I don't think it's a bit too sick. I don't think talk. But really, I, I, I don't like that kind of thing, Sha. You know, not put your business in inside yeah, people. It's yeah, like yeah. private yeah, ones like that. Yeah. But so, but... I, I still, I still don't know how that video got out, honestly. You don't know how that video. Got I don't know how it got out there. It was Neil that called me, just like, Saga, your stuff is online. I'm like, what is online? Uh-uh. You see your proposal video. I had to cut the call around to run inside my room. So you said, Congo discover what all of us discover. I'm and telling you, you don't know how it ends there. Very, very makes me very shy. Ah, honestly, okay. very okay, private but, video. Uh, so, so, but behind uh, me, I see. It's okay. Okay, so now we, now we, now we, now we tie the knot. Tell you what, the video that's skit. That's it. Are you serious? Talk to now. <laughs> Just, don't worry, don't worry. Let's okay, leave. Let's, okay. let's, let's leave that topic. The information, uh, I'll come back for another interview. That was how Saga opened the mouth that he used to eat chicken and turkey to tell us that it was a skit. But was it really a skit? I mean, how can you say a video that was private? And then in the same vein, you're saying it's a skit. Something is not okay. I think the it was not supposed to be public. I think this whole thing was not supposed to be public. Will I believe that it's a skit? Judging from his whole body language, I don't believe it. But it might still be a skit, oh, but isn't it does not believe it. Mm, I don't believe it. Skits. How can it be a skit? And Una never post them since. It's hard to leak. Haba, Muna, rate us more now. Anyways, that's what he said. That is a skit. Mbwano, let's go and drop our ashebi that we dusted before. Let's pack it back into our boxes. Yes, guys. On that note, I'd like to say a very big thank you to all of you for being part of my channel. If you have not yet subscribed, what exactly are you waiting for? Kindly click on the subscription button. Click on the notification bell to let you know whenever I post any new video until i come your way again i remain your darling girl azine williams have yourself a beautiful wonderful day ahead